Hello and welcome to my first playthrough series ever, and it will be a game called Battletech. Uh, with a new campaign. I haven't played this game before, so this will be a first playthrough. I got all the DLCs installed, uh, and I will see. I usually play a lot of RPGs and tactical games, so I think this will be up my alley. Now, uh, intro. I am Kamea of House Serrano. High Lady of the Oregon Reach, Protector of Coromadir, and the Sword of Restoration. But I am not a hero, no matter what the stories say. A hero would have sacrificed more, compromised less. A hero would have done better. You know this, of course. You were there. My father used to tell me stories about the ancient times, about the Star League, a golden age of prosperity, upheld by the great mech warriors of old, guardians of the innocent, protectors of the peace. I always dreamed of following in their footsteps. I was too young to see the truth of things. After all, it wasn't heroism or a noble cause that won me the throne it was hiring a mercenary skilled enough perhaps ruthless enough to carry the day hiring you i still don't know if you fought for honor or for the thrill of it for belief in my cause or just in my money but whether it was your noble heart or mercenary mind your actions gave us hope. That makes you a hero in the eyes of history. Whether you believe it, that's up to you. Hmm, cool. I really like the artwork uh, and stuff like that. Welcome to the Origin Reach. The Origin Reach is a small kingdom in the Rimward periphery. A region of space that lies at the outskirts of the more densely colonized inner sphere. It is a home to the Region Coalition, a federation organized around a parliamentary monarchy and ruled by the Arana family. For three generations, under the rule of House Arano, the Region Coalition has remained a relative, relatively, relatively peaceful corner of the periphery. It is here your story begins. Okay, next. Deca decades ago, your fam family came to the Reach from... The Draconis Combine. Uh, to be fierce, disciplined, relentless fighters, no matter the odds they might face on the battlefield. Although the Draconis Combine is, a, is as eth ethnically diverse as uh, any of the vast interstellar empire, empires, it is also one of the most culturally homogeneous. Omoyena. Blah blah blah. Hmm. Hmm. Like this one. Medieval, medieval Japanese society. Notable descendants of the conquered prince. Continue to shape. Later, a more cohesive populace and military than seen on the other great houses of the inner sphere. Free worlds, the Federated Sons. 
Uh, I wonder what impact uh, my background will have. Doesn't say anything like boss stats or starting. Um, Starting advantages or anything like that. It's different uh, houses, it seems like. Kind of like medieval times, houses and plants. I don't like this one. Uh, most democratic. Donella extinguished in the first succession war. The Federate Sons, a constitution monarchy. Monarchy. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. Socialist police state. Ah, communism, communism. We're a dictator. So, Russia, Soviet. Reward periphery. Different rule, open to any woman, women, uh, supports an open society that ensures the personal liberty of all citizens and the right to live their lives as they see fit. Uh, liberal. Um, military power. Hmm. Ooh, mech wars that hail from the deep periphery are rare, but even rarer is the mech warrior who will admit to such an origin. This could be cool. Um The mercenary who saves the kingdom in the restoration, as she said in the beginning, uh, in the intro. So this might pull. I, I think we will pick this one. Though immigrants to the region reach, your family soon establish a comfortable presence in a small backwater system on the edge of the region space. By the time you were born, your family had become the de facto ruling nobility of the system's only inhabited, uh, inhabited planet. You were the only child heir to the family's titles and ancestral battle mech, an old blackjack BJ-1. This is where you met Raju, Mastiff Montgomery, a veteran of the succession wars, whom your parents hired on for a season to train you as a mech warrior. Raju was strict but a capable, capable teacher and you quickly became a skilled pilot under his tutelage. It was an un unventful life. Hmm, noble birth. Nice. Until the day after your 16th birthday when... Oh, now we get stats. Once the promising young scion of your family, you committed an unforgivable transgression and were sentenced to life in exile. You stole away with the family's ancestral blackjack and set off to find a new life to call your own. Gunnery and tactics. As the heir to a noble family, you grew up, grew up wanting for nothing, and as it turns out, you couldn't stand a life pampered 
of a pampered nobility. Finally, one night you stole away with the family's ancestor Blackjack and set off to find in life. To call your own. Same two lines there as in the first one. Uh, your family went bankrupt. Oh. Some, some, um... Uh, uh, hmm. They changed the uh, wording a bit, but same, same uh, meaning. As you grow older, you watch your family's fortune, income, and influence slowly dwindle away until there was nothing left. Your parents, driven to despair, took their own lives. Ah, don't like that background. Uh, family died in an accident. Piloting and guts. Family was betrayed. Sole surviving member of your house. Uh, I would like what what this means. I would like to know that because ah. I didn't mouse over them long enough. Gunner de determines the chance to hit with ranged weaponry. Higher skill is an effective counter to evasion and an environmental effects that hamper targeting. Guts. Guts improves the maximum health of mech warriors. It also reduces the penalty from weapon recoil and increases the thres thres threshold of heat. The triggers overheating. Piloting. Piloting increases melee hit chance and base sprint distance. It also improves the thresholds of stability to triggers unsteady. Hmm. Tactical. Tactics increases the effectiveness of cold shot opportunities. It also reduces the penalty for indirect fire and improves the minimal range of weaponry. So it seems like there are four skills gunnery tactics, piloting, and guts. 